Hello and welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video, we will be looking at what is the difference between a coordinated turn, a skid and a slip when an aircraft is in flight and the use of a turn coordinator. First, let's understand what is a coordinated turn. To perform a coordinated turn, all three primary flight controls, the ailerons, elevator, and the rudder are required. The ailerons are used to bank the aircraft. The rudder is used to turn the aircraft into the bank. The elevator is used to maintain level flight. A coordinated turn is a smooth turn in which all the forces are perfectly balanced. To ensure a coordinated turn, a turn coordinator on the aircraft instrument panel is used. This shows the aircraft's bank and this shows the amount of yaw or rudder input that is required. Now let's look at what is a skid. A skid can be defined as a condition in which the tail of the aircraft moves away from the center of a turn. This happens because of too much rudder input during a turn along with the aileron input. During a skid, the indication on the turn coordinator will be like this. This means the rudder input has to be reduced. What is a slip? A slip can be defined as a condition in which an aircraft moves sideways and forward or if the aircraft is banking and not turning towards the center of a turn. This happens because of insufficient rudder input during a turn along with the aileron input. During a slip, the turn coordinator will look like this. This means more rudder input is required. A skid versus a slip. A skid is more dangerous when compared to a slip. This is because if the aircraft is flying near its stall speed, a skid would result in an aircraft spin. A slip may be unintentional or intentional. Unintentional slip is because of insufficient rudder input. An intentional slip may be used to increase the rate of descent or to maintain the runway center line during a crosswind landing. So that's all for my video on a coordinated turn, a skid, a slip and the turn coordinator. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, do subscribe and you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.